November 4th, and that means I'm still going on my vlog every day in November project. Yay! So today I saw a video by Charlie is so Charlie is so Charlie is so cool like. You know the Charlie I'm talking about. He posted a video about the things that got him to video blog. And I thought it was really interesting and I thought especially since I just really like kicked up the kicked up a storm with this I'm going to vlog every day for a month project. I thought I might as well explain why I started doing this, you know, cuz it's something that's really important to me and I'm sure you guys are curious. And I'm going to tell you about the YouTubers I like because they are the ones that got me to video blog. One or two years ago, I received a video on my blog. I won't tell you where that is because it's legit personal. I got a post on my blog from someone wishing me happy birthday. And the first video blog that I ever really started watching was Mitchell Davis's blog. And I love Mitchell Davis. He's hilarious and awesome. And I was watching back when he came out with the part two Adventures of Kyle. I love Mitchell Davis and he just he makes me laugh every time and I'm so glad that Kyle is video blogging now too. I'm a Nexus nerd and the lava head. I can be both. Ironically also Charlie really got me into video blogging. Charlie if you're watching this thank you. Me being the huge nerd that I am like honestly I'm bummed that I'm not wearing my Nerdfighter t-shirt today but um I'm wearing it in spirit. It's definitely like the fact that he's like an absolute Doctor Who fan and like loves video games and is like really passionate about vlogging about it. That, like that's so awesome and it really gave me the courage to like come out and be like yeah I'm awesome I love being nerdy yada Naramon and his being able to talk about not only about Twilight and be completely cynical about it but also just being able to talk about anything else that most people would probably shy away from in vlogging like talked about why he was an atheist the other day and that was just like fantastic because I would be totally afraid to say that but that's just so Cool. Basically just all kinds of kudos to the rest of the vlog Vedica crew. Last but not least, the most recent addition to my um, to my need to get onto YouTube is Lil Raj, aka Liam. He's awesome and hilarious and I know he hates hearing this, but he looks a lot like David Tennant. Well every time I'm trying to get someone into it, I'm just like, just go watch this video and I have them I have them watch the video where he explains Viewbees, or not Viewbees, where he explains what he was going to do as a vlog project for September, and he comes out with boobies. <laughs> Those are like the main people that really, really got me into YouTube. There's so many more that I would love to mention, but I feel like I would just end up listing like half the YouTube community. This little awesome cluster of YouTube, YouTubiness. Anyways. That's about all for me today. I'll see you tomorrow. Remember, remember the 5th of November? I'll get into that tomorrow. Bye, guys. Before I go, one more thing. I just want to congratulate Christopher Wilsonholm of the, uh, of the bassist of Muse variety. He had his fifth child today, Buster Wilsonholm, and I just wanted to say congratulations, Chris. It's like a huge accomplishment and all the Muse fans are so happy for you and we really hope you stop crying eventually, but <laughs> we love you, Chris.